The Road to Fatalis was the series that started it all. From humble beginnings to defeating Fatalis, the journey from beginning to end is something I will never forget. But now it's time to leap back into the fray. Every crown, every treasure, every achievement is mine for the taking. And I would like for you to join me in this new journey to undertake a whole new challenge. My name is Alexander Moon, and this is The Road to Platinum. to be back in the saddle. Unfortunately, the saddle's taking me straight into Behemoth. <laughs> I was away for two weeks, now we're back. So, the game plan is, I have to do the special assignment and then the optional quest is unlocked. But what I'm going to do is, I'm going to do the special assignment in a group and then the optional quest I will complete solo. I'm gonna be using a bow because something something Egon in Bale the Dread. <laughs> you got an Egon costume? Is there an Egon costume? What does he look like? I mean, is there a, a bow override that looks like his bow? Is it kind of like twisted and knotted wood or something like that? Hello, Discord. Maybe this Thornwing bow, but hello, Discord. <laughs> Didn't worry about that later. <laughs> well, I guess, we, <laughs> I guess we just go fight Behemoth. <laughs> so just to reiterate, we're doing the special assignment in multiplayer to unlock the optional quest, and I'm going to do the optional quest solo. And then we will finally be done with all optional quests in LR, HR, and MR. Hopefully. If I look back at that after killing Behemoth and I see it's a blue complete sign, I'm going to be salty. Oh boy. Not happy to see that <laughs> duty commence pop up again. Can't tell where his weak points are with these number of delays. He's already moving on. <laughs> yes. Beat his freaking ass. <laughs> Oh, cosmic. Oh. <laughs> Honestly, just want to see what kind of numbers this is going to do. <laughs> Crafty cosmic. Okay. <laughs> certainly goes a hell of a lot smoother on, <laughs> like, with MR gear. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Finally. Ugh. Now I have to do it solo. <laughs> Risen and piss, you won't be missed. Yeah, that's basically how I fucking feel right now. Ah. <laughs> Cosmo, you just pointed straight to my camera. <laughs> Already. <laughs> my uh, hunter is just completely unfazed. <laughs> like not even one of the, one of the like emotes of like waving or something like that. It just stands there staring. <laughs> like good fucking rinse. <laughs> Already. <laughs> Y'all drinking in there? <laughs> he hasn't even posted the quest yet. <laughs> Ugh, I tell you fucking what though, <laughs> I'm gonna go need to do this before heading out fighting Behemoth. I was hunting. I'm about to take on Behemoth solo. <laughs> and Cosmic is very insistent. I go to the quest counter. <laughs> uh, I have had too much to drink. Uh, this is proper guild protocol. It is today. All right. Optional quests. Yes, finally, there it goes. Fucker. Ugh. Absolutely miserable fight. Trying way too hard to make it like the other game. When it's not the other game, it needs to be this game. God damn it. Shitty crossovers like this make me not fucking care about the other game that's being crossed over with. I don't give a shit about The Witcher, I don't give a shit about Final Fantasy, because this game treated them fucking terribly. I'm 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 so over it. I'm I'm over it. I don't give a shit about this anymore. I just want the quest done. I'm I'm done. I I hate it. It needs, it just needs to be done. I don't care about doing this solo anymore. 
This is bottom of the fucking barrel content, and I don't want to see it again. Gear up, we're slaughtering another behemoth. Even the fucking tip section is like, hey, this is poorly designed, go use crutches. There we go. Fucking hell. Quit staring at me like that, Behemoth. <laughs> now we can actually have fun! <laughs> Ugh. Uh, we gotta do research. And complete more armor sets. And I think... I forgot I had to do treasures as well, but I'll, I'll still do all that off camera, I think. Tails! Tails, I, I was gonna be fighting Behemoth solo, but it's it's so bad. I had to get help from, from Cosmic. That was my time away. It was good. If I have to fight, if I ever have to fight him again, I'm I'm getting the uh, I'm getting the squad in on it. <laughs> he may, may as well not be in the game. Yeah, but I mean, when I was in HR and Road to Fatalis, the uh, Behemoth armor set was in like pretty much all of them, so kind of had no choice there. So basically, the things that we don't uh, that aren't like crown related is just research and then treasure, and then we get the crowns, and to top it all off, we'll get the uh, well done steak achievement. <laughs> Research. What do I need to research still? Da, 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 da. I think it's yeah, Kieran, Lunastra, yeah, Kieran, Lunastra, Kushala Deora, and Brute Tigrex. Can I see Alex get the final achievement? Hell yeah! <laughs> I think we fight Kieran. This is the <laughs> natural safe crafty split into. <laughs> oh no! Let me just real quick uh, turn in ecology info, and we'll start hunting some Kieran. Now, this is where I get that Kinsect, right? Hey. Yeah, Dragon Soul. That's cool. Wait, hold on. Kieran. Where's Kieran? I keep skipping over it. Oh, we have research maxed out with Kieran. I just had to give the uh, info in. Okay, so... Kushala Diora. Crazy how much stuff is in the game? Yeah. It's been a freaking journey, that's for sure. How many crowns do I have left? A lot, actually. Um, Probably too many to put into small list. Let's see, uh, for minis, I am 45% complete. For great crowns, I'm 34% complete. And that's across both base game and iceborne. From one tornado monster to the other, huh? <laughs> uh, I am gonna be getting Hunter Pie to kind of make the process a bit more streamlined, because, I mean, it's gonna be the, basically the last thing that I do for achievements. So I figured that at that point I'll have earned it. Oh yeah, I need to, I need to do uh, all armor sets too. I'm gonna do armor sets before tackling crowns as well. So we're not hitting hitting up crowns as quick. Tell Cosmic they don't spam their weapon emotes fast enough. <laughs> you hear that, Cosmic? You need to go faster. <laughs> oh Jesus! <laughs> Boom. <laughs> What happened? Oh. Yes. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> Apparently, in wilds, you aren't going to be able to do a uh, guard point into SAD. It's going to be a uh, like guard point into AED. But I think if you do a perfect guard. Uh, then you'll do SAD, and I don't know if guard points are considered like perfect guards or something. I don't know. It, it, it's gonna be a while before we have wilds, so mechanics are yet to be known. Gonna have to actually get good then. <laughs> I mean, there's plenty of time to get good at world before wilds comes out. It's probably gonna be like another six months minimum if it doesn't come out in uh, in March. Also, uh, as long as your shield is charged, you don't need to have energy waiting in your files in order to charge your sword. As long as the shield is charged, it, it'll take slightly longer because you aren't charging your files, but you can charge your sword without files being ready to load. It's like like minimal charge time or like minimal uptime on that kind of charge, but it just, you know, it gets your sword going so you don't bounce off of the uh, hard parts. This weapon is ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. Now you know why I have, why I have like 500 uses. <laughs> when when going into axe to sword form, the the end of the animation is a guard point as well, <laughs> which is something I hardly ever make use of. And I think the end of the animation of shield charging might be a guard point, but I'm honestly not sure. Yeah. Let me, let me see how many uses I have for charge blade. I can't view it from here. Alrighty. The gold charge blade last week that was elemental files and Namiel armor set bonus. It was incredible. Oh yeah, I've been meaning like. Once uh, Road to Platinum is done, I really want to do a uh, Methods for Madness thing for uh, for Monster Hunter rather than Warframe. 
And it's gonna, I, I have that kind of like element uh, build in mind. I also want to do, see, what, what, what was it? There was one other thing involving like status. And then Cosmic uh, recently made a, uh, a set that uses heroics and Safi armor that I want to <laughs> verify the usability of. <laughs> Torture set, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it files, but whatever. Yes. Fuck yeah. What's my favorite monster? Uh, Zenogre. My favorite one to fight would probably be uh, either a Dogron or actually Arc Tempered Volcana. Because <laughs> I'm a, a freaking psychopath. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we need one more research level for Kushala Diora. Those are like polar opposites. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cosmic's already- <laughs> I left the room for two seconds and you're already pissed drunk. <laughs> I like to fight this cute little red dog, and then <laughs> I like to fight the literal Iceborne Wyvern. <laughs> you're a snow demon. <laughs> you get so much distance on that, good lord. You think you're safe up there? Come here, you. Ugh. <laughs> there we are. Yes. Do, do you know that while charging, you can uh, slinger burst your hammer? Or with your hammer, rather. So whenever you got something charging at you, you can just go like that. <laughs> Ledge deck! <Ugh>. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Smack it right in the face. Oh, hey, JJ. <laughs> I love that you just fell in from off screen. Oh, that's amazing. Where are you? <laughs> hey, research. Hey, all right, we're maxed research with Kshala Deora. Yeah, I feel like insurance, nice. We're gonna need it. Yeah, especially if we're gonna have to fight like five Lunastras in a row. Ugh. Yep, Lunastra. <laughs> Ugh, five faints. Okay, yeah, we're <laughs> we're we're solid. <laughs> I'm trying to wallbang. Ugh. Out of here. I just picked up a large elder dragon jam. <laughs> what the fuck? How what there's no way her tail swipe hits in front of her. That's so shit. There's actually no way. Literally made her to be unfair. That's so stupid. She said this hatred fuels her heart, yeah. That's convenient. Why wouldn't that just hit behind her, too? Wow. I think we might be able to run ahead of her here. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. <laughs> do we even have a good wake up for, for this? Alright, well, I guess uh, follow my lead. <laughs> We're gonna do a Hellbreaker. <laughs> Alright, you guys ready for this shit? Okay. Oh, that works. <laughs> Yo, okay, jump breaker, let's go. <laughs> there we go. Number one of five freaking million that we have to fight. <laughs> Tails. Yo. <laughs> 34 side mushrooms, yeah. He just does that sometimes. <laughs> oh my god, Boris. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he's getting hit by Star Platinum or something. <laughs> yes! 
I can't feel my face. <laughs> Great work. <laughs> it's those devil devil splice will get you good. <laughs> Astra is such a tool. I hate this thing. Jesus. I'm being microwaved. And focused. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, yeah. The Lord Astra does not like me right now. As soon as I walk back over, she just is just on me. Good lord. What do you want from me? Holy fuck! Master <laughs> knows who you are, she wants that twitch clip of her fainting you. Yeah. Yes! Don't think I've seen you stream since Raging Bracky? Yeah, man, that's been months at this point. <laughs> Time for ten more! <laughs> I've <feast> plenty. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> having mushrooms force fed to everyone. <laughs> Yeah, Ardian's got a couple pieces ready. Actually, I think I can craft all the Ardian, Ardian pieces now. Yeah, I just need the Meltsvar. Wait, no. No, I thought this, I thought this was complete for some reason. I need two more Ancient Fragments and the Meltsvar and Flood Sex, and that'll be done. Is there a G-Sex flavor you would recommend for someone who hasn't had any before? Um, I would just say, like, scroll through it all. Uh, the, the descriptions for each flavor are, will tell you what they are. Personally, I really like, um the lemon lime or the just melon because uh, the just melon is like honeydew melon. G7 has been on your radar for a while. I enjoy it a lot, honestly. Oh, <laughs> crafty, <laughs> crafty, what are you doing? <laughs> You're melding faces for a second there. <laughs> oh, that's probably gonna ruin it. Yep. <laughs> That's probably a really bad place to be fighting Luna. <laughs> I'm just gonna chill up here. <laughs> Thunderdome, yeah. Thunderdome. <laughs> this is ridiculous, what are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> I don't really have a good wake up for this, so. There we go. We're almost. What well, I was about to say, and I was, <laughs> I was about to say we're almost done with Lunastra, but then I saw it used to. It's like a small break from Lunastra and hunt a different monster. Was it just Lunastra and Brute Tigrex left? It is, yep, Lunastra and. Brute Tigrex. And that's it. So let's go max out Brute Tigrex, I guess. Can't wait for wilds. I can't either, dude. I just want it so much. Have y'all seen how freaking crazy Wyvern Fire is now? Like, holy crap, it's literally like a cannon. Yeah, someone who uh, was allowed to record the demo uh, caught like a side profile of the uh, of the Wyvern Fire. It was insane. <laughs> Goodies the crap out of Gun Gun Lance and Wilds. Oh yeah, <laughs> me too. Like, it's starting to look like it would be like my favorite weapon, even beyond Charge Blade. Like, that's just how crazy it looks. <laughs> the chat with the, the sticker and the feelings are hurt. <laughs> hey, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> is there an armor piece that, or like a, like an armor skill that increases the rate you get research? Could have sworn there was something like that. A skill called Scholar, which is which does what you want. Oh, okay, right. It must be a charm, I think. I remember vaguely. Hello, background noise. I remember vaguely there being something like that. Where is it? Scholar. Here we go. Speeds up progress on research levels and special investigations. Perfect. This tiger is just, just not letting me do what I want. For fuck's sake! Dude! Your tiger roaster makes the stream lag. <laughs> I think Brankidio's roaring in the background is making the 
like the the screen blur that you get whenever a monster roars. <laughs> what the hell? There we go. <laughs> hey, level four, nice. Now we just got Lunastra. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Yes. Yeah, I have no files either. I'm just gonna do this. Yeah. I guess I'll see if there's any armor pieces to craft, and we'll call it there for the day. Sure hope I don't need the crown. <laughs> I still need the uh, the mini crown for Lynastra. Just need two more ancient fragments and one flood sack, and we can finally stop worrying about Ardian. Yeah, we still need melt bar and shards for that. Need Barno. Oh, right. I was gonna get Barno's hard claws for this, but then I, I crashed, and just kind of forgot about it. And tough claws for tiger X pieces too. On that note, and a couple of the Nastra pieces. Oh, yeah. Right, Shell Dior. All right. So for the armor, we're basically done. We just need a few more dragon vein bones, which I think we have to get from the Guiding Lands, and a few more Cortexes. We should get that while we're going for the... whatchamacallit? Oh, that's the wrong one. There we go. <laughs> we should have, end up getting that while going for the research, and Lid Astra being the last one kind of sucks, but I mean, hey, at least this is the last one we gotta research. <laughs> 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 I love the post spamming thing. Thank you for stopping by. I will see you guys later. Oh god, the game almost crashed. <laughs> yeah, thank you for stopping by. I will see you guys later.